how engineers do it. Before we start today's video, I would like to ask all my viewers to subscribe to my YouTube channel How Engineers Do It, to share the video among all of your friends, and also hit the bell icon to never miss another update. In this video, we're going to be seeing how we can create a dynamic hyperlink to another sheet in Excel. So in order to understand that, first we're going to be creating a static hyperlink. And to do that, what we use is the hyperlink function equal to hyperlink. Right? And double click on that. And then first we show the location of the sheet. Right? So to do that, you open the quotes, double quotes, and then what we do is first we use the hash and then we write the name of the sheet. So let's say in this case we write John and then we give an excl exclamation and then inside the sheet John where do we want the cursor to be placed once we click on the hyperlink. And in this case I'm going to be mentioning it as, it as A1 and then uh, close the double quotes and then uh, a comma and then we give a friendly name to the link. Let's say that we are calling it as link and I close this and I have the link hyperlink over here. Once I click on this, it's going to be going to that John sheet and it's going to be placing the cursor on right the first column and uh, on the first row. So that is A1, right? Now if I change this, now if I just go ahead and change it to, uh, let's say John, I change it to some other name uh, of another sheet, let's say Sam, and if I click on that, it's going to be taking to Sam, right? And if I do that for Eddie, it's going to be taking to the Eddie sheet. Now, how can we make this hyperlink is what we're going to be seeing here. Now, in this case, you have this link over here. If I change uh, from the drop down, if I change it to Sam, and if I click here, it's going to be taken to Sam. And likewise, if I go ahead and change it to Eddie and click on this, it's going to be changing to Eddie. So all I do, did over here, it's it's almost the same formula. The only thing I'm doing here is it's uh, for the sheet name, it's going to be taking from the B3 here, right? So I'm going to be writing that formula again, that is hyperlink, and then open, and then link location would be, I put a double quote and uh, the hash, and then uh, I put the uh, ampersand, and then take this name here, right? Again, put an ampersand, and again, open the double quote, and then put an exclamation, and then you mention the place where you want the cursor to go, and close, and then comma, and then the friendly name. So let's say, let's just call it as link, and that's it, right? Now, if I just click here, it's going to be taking to Eddie here, right? If I change it to Sam, it's going to be taking to Sam. I hope this video is helpful. Thank you for watching, and stay tuned.